everybody we had 10 students uh, we had 10 mathematics and statistics students and another maybe 25 researchers maybe equal number of teachers researchers and teachers are equal and post graduate students are less because it's a total research oriented uh, that time cochin university was supposed to be like an iit then um, i disproved a theorem and then everybody was thinking it's not possible how do you prove prove by step by step how do you disprove creating a example which will contradict the theorem so i created an example which will contradict the theorem i would have been a nobel laureate of mathematics <laughs> there is no nobel laureate in mathematics anyway but then af- after three days head of the department called me and said you are a very good advocate anything right can be proved wrong anything wrong can be proved right so i'm blessing you to become an advocate is it <laughs> but you need a lot of courage to say something is wrong in front of people who believe that is right right i was such a student the linear algebra was taught by a, a good mathematics teacher who was tamburatti from the palace kovilagam and uh, another teacher was also ganapati ganapati was a very re- really a, a great mathematics professor so when he asked me to prove something i will write maybe the proof in the textbook can be written in half page i will write to two three pages and he will ask where are you taking me i am not able to read please x for evaluating he used to call me on the table and say explain it i am not able to understand why are you going like this i said it's my proof not the textbook proof so i used to prove in my style always had great fun with the teachers knowingly i know how to write that precisely but i used to write it in a different style try something out that trial happens in the classroom only not in the exam hall only not even in the class because <laughs> i know how, i know how to write i don't remember that actually so i don't remember i and first may i know the theorem that you i will have to sir look at it i i'm not very sure it was it was a great fun that time but we forgot all of us forgot but then later uh, we were recollecting those days uh, when i read about uh, ramanujan it was like when he sat on the rock just beside the temple premises everything was coming on his mind the proofs were appearing and uh, it's just coming from the devi he said no uh, ramanujam was very fast in doing many things that is why when he met hardy hardy was asking why are you writing uh, question and answer sort of a thing steps are not written so if yes. steps are not written it is very difficult for a common person to understand why can't you write all the details immediately hardy said don't waste time in writing the details because if we start writing the details that much time will be lost mm-hmm. because between that time he will make another three theorems it was like producing theorems from a factory sort of a thing right so he said write theorems uh, proofs later now start writing theorems so he will write one line one answer one line one answer but unfortunately he was not long lived for proving them right so even today so, even today people are struggling to find the proofs for what he has written long long back so you personally feel that 
such a theorem and proof everything will be there on our head at the right time see um, most of them is like you know what it is not scientifically explainable how you are getting that it is very hard it just comes to some people at that point of time that's it so what happens is you are able to predict what uh, is going to happen when some some question comes they get the answer immediately you don't even have to think for an answer so they had that blessing that's it beyond that there is no explanation how is it happening why is it happening and all it's very difficult to explain